Good afternoon. Welcome to sunny Amsterdam, sun-dried Amsterdam. I was just staying in the cafe over there. It's my favorite place, Cafe Magari. I was just staying in front of the place under the sun. A bit sunbathing. You know, we were lucky on the previous live stream also today. Last weekend on Saturday it was 25 Celsius and today it's 20. But the wind is lighter than the previous week, so today is better. Today is better. I have a matcha latte with soy milk. We're gonna explore the streets. It's too crowded actually. It's very crowded. Uh, before coming here, I was in the pipe in Albert Carp Market with my friends, Hungry Man Kitchen family, and we got some nice street food and also some nice drinks. And from there I got here by Metro. And it's crazy here. Look at the crowds. Look at the queue. Oops, there's a little accident here. Just a second, I will check the live chat. Hello everybody. Another unlimited live stream walking tour in Amsterdam. If you are new on this channel, this live stream tour is going to take like one and a half hour probably. We will be walking around the Centrum area. Let me see if you, if you can hear me, by the way. Okay, Tommy san good morning. Sundar is here. Tibor, Travel AI, good morning. Sebastian Peter Mulder, Huidah, what a sale, hello. Paul Harnett. And Leo Hartman, Wang Tong. Sorry if I miss someone. <coughs> Peter van Tilburg, new to channel, welcome. Welcome on board from Massachusetts. It's not easy to pronounce it to me. So <laughs> Peter van Tilburg, welcome. Paul and Tan Hats, Ginge is here as usual. Thank you guys for coming. Let's check around. So, if you are a bit familiar with Amsterdam, we, you know that already we are around the Canal Belt area, Canal Belt. This is Singal Canal, the first canal in the Canal Belt of Amsterdam, and this is the beginning of the 9th Street area. The stylish shopping district is starting from here and continuing with the other streets, other 6 streets. Three of them is on this side. But this queue on the bridge, it's not for the coffee shop over there, strain hunters. There's a coffee shop, but this queue is not for that. This queue is extension of the real queue in that narrow street, the little alley. There is a famous cookie store over there. It's Fanstapale cookies. Let's have a look. We have a professional here. Look at that. I hope the sound level is good because I noticed that in <coughs> I noticed that in the previous videos the sound was too high. It was a bit annoying. I noticed a bit late. Sorry about that. Today it's lower. Hope you can hear me clearly. Please leave your comments if you cannot hear clearly. So this line continue to the little alley. We're gonna go through that little alley. See, okay, okay. I think everything is all right. Sound is good. That's great. By the way, before we continue, I will show you a private boat tour. I just met with a very nice guy, a Dutch guy, who organized boat tours, private boat tours with historic information. I will just show the boat first and. If we can, we will talk to the guy. This is the boat. This is a rental boat, so you can rent it with minimum five people, and minimum three hours. Boat cruise in Amsterdam with this beautiful boat. And there are drinks and snacks inside. The maximum capacity is 10 people. There's a background side, backside over there. 
and with your private friend group or some family people with your family you can rent it and total price is 300 euro with minimum five persons so if you are five person for three hours boat trip in Amsterdam you pay only 300 euro in total it's a great price in my opinion I'll try to talk to the owner so you can get a more clear idea by the way during the boat cruise he tells about historical information about Amsterdam so it's not just a boat tour also during the tour he mentioned all the important things about Amsterdam history most of them are unique things I think this is a wedding wedding boat that one also the similar oh here I'm coming <laughs> I was about to come to you, we are live, by the way. Oh, I'm, nice. I mentioned very briefly about the boat tours. I, I hope it's correct information. Three hours with minimum five people, minimum three hours. It's possible to rent the boat with historical information. Maybe you can add something else. Uh, this is from 1926 and I'm by far the most passionate historian on the water. So you, have to, you will have the most beautiful boat and you will have the best tour guides available. You. You tell all the information about Amsterdam. Absolutely, Definitely. I do. Okay, okay. Let, let me show you the boat a little bit. Yes, two person here, and there's a covered area and the open area. So there is not there is not a specific departure time, right? It depends right. on the group. Uh, I prefer ten o'clock, but uh, mm -hmm. if you say you want to do a bit later, no problem. I do do one tour a day, and I do this only one hundred times a year. So it is quite um, yeah. limited. I see, okay. And there are drinks inside, I think, yeah. with uh, extra payments, I, I think. Oh, sure, uh, everything is possible. Yeah, okay, that's great. So, you saw the boat, you saw the guy here. Thanks. The captain, the historian. <laughs> the captain is here, historian, the captain. The local. Just keep in your mind, next to Cafe Magari, our friend Cafe Magari, Maggie is here. And next to that, you can find this professional here. Hi guys, hope to see you soon <laughs> on the boat. See you soon. And an Thank you. Have hey. a good day. See bye you. bye. Bye bye. <laughs> so you got the idea. I just met today and this is Cafe Magari. Next to that you can find the captain. Or you can ask information to Cafe Magari. She can help you. Maggie is inside. It's, it's not a... It's not an order. How are you? <laughs> Beautiful weather. <laughs> Great. Enjoying samba. <laughs> yeah. This is this is the famous cookie store place, by the way. Give me a sec. Let me see if you any of you have questions. <laughs> Best tours, <laughs> nice boat. Yeah, it's a, it's an extraordinary boat tour. You know, it's not a, it's not an ordinary one. There are many boat tours in Amsterdam around the canals, and you can rent your own boat, etc. But this one, including historical information, is free. Comes free with the boat tour. The cookie store is about to close, but look at the crowd here. King, King Tim is here. Woo! I stuck here. Did you have a Oh yeah, cookies. Sorry. You see how crowded is the place. It's the famous cookie store. But 95% uh, of the people waiting here, they are tourists. Visitors, first time buyers, etc. I don't see many locals. Around. Look at that. There is a freestyle performance over there. I don't know what kind of dance is this. What is that? I don't know, but I'm. <laughs> oh, At okay. least they're free. I don't know. Yeah. 
Almost free. <laughs> Almost free. <laughs> I mean, like, they have no fear of men. I respect that. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, they just, I, I don't know, they just do their thing. <laughs> Which I think is respectable. <laughs> I don't know, it's crazy. I think so, I think yeah. so. Uh, I couldn't catch from the beginning. No, <laughs> they were just dancing crazy. <laughs> Have a good day. Have a good day. the ball. Okay, okay. Which means you got let me let me show you the spa corner, the Brabansa up bar. That corner is also a bit busy. And the Konings plan just on the next corner. This is Spa Strat. You lucky guys, you caught the bells again. Bell lovers. You see the outside terraces are full today. Due to the good weather, it's very rare to find this kind of weather because before June normally. It's a bike traffic here. Just in time. We are still next to single canal. This one. Flower market is over there. The Bulova market and the street goes to light supply. Thumbs up please, yes. Thanks, Nightbot, we are the best. 11 hour experiments. Hello there. happening here everyone is so busy with the phones hey Demirji is back welcome Demirji long time no see how are you De Demirji heard the church bells It's echo echoed in Izmir, it seems. Guys, be careful when you park your bikes around this canal area. Municipality officers can take them and transfer them to to municipality bike storage area and then you have to pay to get it back because normally it's not allowed to park here as I know. Yeah, it's, it says it's not allowed to park your bike or scooter here. And if you cannot find it when you're back, when you're back, you can call that number or you can visit that website to learn how to get it back. Tickets for tram metro bus. Let's check the prices. One hour trip, three euro and forty cents. For one hour, you can use tram, bus, or metro with the same ticket. 
the price is 3 euro and 40 cents. This square is called Konings Plan, Konings King's Square in English. And right at the corner of King's Square, there is a fish stall that you can try. The famous Dutch herring fish. It's closed already. It's closed. We are late. But normally every day is open. Herring fish or some other fish sandwich stuff. You can find it here. This way goes to Lysa Plain. If you walk just 10 minutes. Just 10 minutes walking and you will be in the entertainment square of Amsterdam. And the flower market's entrance is here, that small street. And left side you can see the uh, flower stalls. Let me see something orange. David Zuckerman, thank you, Murat, from David and Ken in Los Angeles. Thank you, David and Ken. Here we go. Thanks for the super chat. Los Angeles. What happened to that big tree that used to be there? Well, to be honest, I can't remember where it was placed before, unfortunately. And so I don't know the history about that. You want to check the flower market? Let's have a look. Long time no walk through the flower market. Here it is. It's the perfect temperature. See Bob Sweet certificate inside. Yeah. As usual, it's pretty crowded. About six o'clock, they close these shops. Normally, the stores, these flower stores, you can find all kinds of tulips and also other stuff like bonsai tree for example one bonsai tree seed is 350 euro and three of them 10 euro but it's not easy to grow that stuff so those are some other seeds and plants Remember that this is this is not the place where locals locals buy their plants or flowers or bulbs. No, it's a pretty touristic area. So the prices are the prices are higher than the places where locals are shopping. Okay. Postcard is one euro and fifty cents. Amsterdam postcards. Amsterdam socks ten euro. No, four euro. Sorry, long socks four euro. Three of them ten euro. With uh, cannabis decoration the design, green stuff design. Three of them ten euro.
photo shoot spots. You can get your Dutch clocks and you can take a picture here. There are some similar uh, spots uh, throughout the city. This is your place, Tommy san There's a small Japanese store here next to Henry Willich. GGM cheeses. And there's no G at the end. G, G is stolen. <coughs> and this one is chief storage, another one. Cars Calder. Look at that. 50, 50 tulip bulbs. 10 euro, the whole package. Typical Holland magnets, 3 euro and 50 cents. An Amsterdam magnets, posters, 8 euro. Printed posters, Magic Mushroom Place. Um, we have these five. So. <laughs> so, like 100 years ago, I mean, in 1912, it says it was a tobacco store. Now it's a tourist souvenir shop, I mean, like a head shop. They sell uh, touristic souvenirs or some space cake stuff, you know. Okay, not kimonos, yukatas, yukatas. Thanks for the Japanese info, Tomisan san Tomisan san, -san. <laughs> Hello, ORF from Chicago. Welcome. I'm good, Demirje. Thanks very much. We are enjoying Izmir weather in the middle of Amsterdam. Look at that. Who wants a short with Amsterdam buildings or tulips? Tulips design. Another cheese store. Okay, enough flower market. Let's go back quickly. I mean, from the other side. It seems Spotify headquarters are here. here. Look at that bottle holder. Two strap. One is five euro. This one. Why will you need a bottle holder? You are not in the middle of ocean. You are not in a tropical island, you know, you don't have to buy it. I don't recommend it to you. Instead, you can bring your reusable cups or bottles to Amsterdam and there are more than 100 uh, drinking water points in Amsterdam city. In the in many important corners and squares of the city you can find drinking water points and so you can fill your reusable bottles you don't have to buy amsterdam drinking water is clean you can drink it from the tap okay finish the coffee it was matcha actually matcha latte I, I love the design of this uh, flowers store. I'll try to show it. There are like thousands of flowers on the ceiling. This is Munch Plain. Munt Square and Munt Tower. If you go right, just two minutes walking away, there is Rembrandt Plain. 
at the end of the street. By the way, guys, this video is gonna end up in a bar. We're gonna drink a little beer or Geneva together. I hope that will be a happy ending to me. All right. That's the shopping street, Kalferstrat. Let's follow Rock inside a little bit. Maybe we can get into Kalferstrat later. Let's see the Amstel River water from a close-up angle. We have 108 watchers. Thanks very much, guys. Don't forget thumbs up. It's a big help. for recommending of these videos to more people. <laughs> it's a quite windy day, but uh, the temperature is good, so it's a warm, warm wind. That's why I can walk around with my t-shirt only. But if you remember, last Saturday we were in Scheveningen. It was 25 Celsius. Today is 20. Now, now it's 19, I think. But in Scheveningen I was wearing my jacket because it was a cool, cool wind. Today is a warm wind. It's coming from south, it seems. This is Rocking and this is extension of Amstel River. Do it again. Though. Water. You see, you click the like button and we have already more people on the live chat. 118 people. Thank you very much. So it works. It's a good day to have a boat tour. By the way, two weeks later, there is King's Day, King's birthday, and it's a big celebration in Amsterdam. If you are around, don't miss 27th of April, Saturday. The whole city is going to be a festival area. Another boat is coming. Albert Peter, this one. It's a covered one with this type of weather conditions it's better to prefer open boats instead of these ones. These ones are good for rainy weathers or cold weathers but with a sunny day like this you can choose a, an open boat tour I think. Instagram phenomenon Great. And three grafias. That's the departure point of that boat tour, the one we have just seen. Look, there's a naked garbage bin here. Yeah. 
that way it goes to other sides for Brook Wall um, to the, the Wallen area. That was uh, going to Amsterdam Central Station, I guess, through Krim, Krimberg Wall, I think. So this one is an open boat tour example. It's 20 euro for one and a half hour tour or one hour. I can't do that. And then one hour. One hour tour is 20 euro with that one. And you can order your drinks inside. They are getting ready to departure. It's not that full, probably like in 15 minutes. Departure every 20 minutes, it says. And this one is also one hour boat tour for adults, about 15 euro. Let's take a look to this side. As you see, there are also constructions around this area. This is a ticket desk. There's a great balcony over there. A restaurant, Mexican restaurant, terrace. Let's take a look to the side street here and then we will return to Rocking area again. We'll look at the history here to the building. Amazing. Downstairs is a bakery. And next one is the Mexican restaurant. We saw the balcony just a minute ago. There's a secret passage, passage here. There are some restaurants and cafes inside. Chbet zonder end. Without end. No end on that little alley. Oh, look at that. Ministry of Law.nl Photography Gallery. Oh, be careful. You'll drop the lady. <laughs> well, we have just missed another vital video chance. He couldn't, he couldn't drop the girl to the water. <laughs>
These buildings are part of Amsterdam University. Oops, the cleaning services are on the way. Oh, they are lifting the car. We're gonna walk through that bridge to connect to Rocken again. It says, please stay still. Don't make noise here. It's a residential area, it says. Maybe instead of working, better to continue on this way so we can reach to the Valan area. A little change in our lives. Instead of seeing the rocking, let's check the, the Wallen area, the bars, the atmosphere. So I changed my mind about going through this bridge. Yeah, we can already see the development border over there. It's a, another name of the Wallen is, if you don't know that, Red Zone District. I don't want to say the whole name. But of course we are not going to see the hard worker ladies. I couldn't follow up the chat, let me see what you guys are talking. That boss is using a public community. <laughs> yeah. Tucson, hello there. Have a good day. And Chucky. Salkan, hello. Roy loves sun-dried tomatoes. We haven't been to the monkey bar for a while. Yes, that's right. I have been to many times, but not together with you. Uh, so let's see. But uh, I'm afraid it will be crowded today. We're gonna take a look. Maybe we can have a drink together there. Or maybe somewhere, somewhere new. Fort Vent, Amsterdam, you are the best. Thank you. There's a little pool here. Ikea banks. Ikea banks. 
all these smoke boat departure points. So, oh, here he is. <laughs> you are the owner. Hello, how are you? <laughs> yeah, fine. How are you? I'm good. Is YouTube live stream? It's okay. I, I make live stream walking tours and I always see the smoke boats. Yeah. And I, first time I see the yeah, price. Yeah, we are working from here. Yeah. Can you give some information? How is the price? What they can do inside? Yeah, it's tour duration, one hour included one drink. You can smoke inside our boat, whatever you want. But don't okay. forget to bring it because we don't sell nothing on our boat. Okay, inside you, they don't sell it. Yeah, you so you it. should bring it with yourself. Your your. Okay. Or something like this. <laughs> How long you said? One, one, hour? one hour, yeah, duration one hour across the most popular canals, mm -hmm. Amsterdam. The, the Wallen area. And the, yeah. Okay, okay, great. Maybe another time we can join, is it possible, with the camera on live stream? Yeah, you I can. Mean, I can show myself. Yeah. I don't bother other customers, Nobody don't will worry. worry about this. Yeah. Yeah. Just they will be high. <laughs> listen to music, yeah. <laughs> Okay, okay. Then another time I will join to the water okay. on live stream. Thank you. Sorry. Good day. You heard it, you heard it. There will be a special smoke boat tour in the future. Wait, follow my travels. Here they, they have also bike. If you are high enough, you can also cycle on the canals. Very tough. This I think is a flower bike man production, it seems, probably. And you know how Amsterdam people love ducks. There are many duck stores around. And this is their logo. And there's a public urinary here. A few years ago, during pandemic time, I think, police found a man here. He was uh, sleeping inside. He was staying there, homeless guy. He was staying and sleeping in the public urinary. On the next sunny, sunny weather, next good weather, we will be on a smoke boat tour with a guest. Okay, the traffic is stuck here. Those are some popular places by you guys. Rick's Coffee Shop, Smart Shop, Rock Planet. There's a lot of music bars. I think Susie's Salon is over there. And also, there are two coffee shops here, I think. One of them is Greenhouse. Okay, we are at the border of the Wallen area. This must be the most crowded place in the centrum. Other than Damrak and Kalfersrad, you see the crowd here on the bridge. It's the most crowded spot here at the moment. Dam Square is just on the next corner, only 100, 200 meters away from here. Yes, waiting for the cars, stuck here. Okay, we made it. Here is the infamous, infamous uh, red zone, right side. It's 
some other boat tour companies you can get inside here to the boat tour. Look at the weather. It's just awesome. Look at that. What a slogan. It says cakes solves everything. Another photo spot is here. I'm all already thirsty guys, I need to find a place and get a drink together then we can continue maybe. Let me think where we can get a little, a uh, little Turkish tea. Well, the right side, oh, there, there was also a bridge here, not here, any longer. It seems they are also renovating this bridge. On the next street, that's the main, main uh, street of the red zone, there was a 3D bridge and it was also uh, taken off, it, it took off there. I mean, it's not there any longer. And this one is also, so from here to the next two streets two canals you cannot continue you have to choose the other ways so on the right side there are some women at work let's say women at work If there's such good weather, just like this lady, you have to get a takeaway food and you can just eat or drink on the canal way. But uh, don't forget that in public it's not allowed to drink alcohol in Amsterdam. But you can eat like this takeaway food on the historic Amsterdam canal belt area. Under the sun, of course, is if the temperature is good enough. And it's not always like that. The table and chairs on the right side, it's not a cafe. They are the people living here and they are in their... They are... Let me see. They are staying in front of their house. On the street. We are pretty close to the old church in distance. You can see the tower of the old church from the 13th century. David can't wait to be back in two months to Nijmegen. David, I will try to visit Nijmegen before you come. So I will check if everything is safe in the city before your arrival. I will take all the measures before you visit Nijmegen for the concert. I'll do my best, don't worry. Yes, the other side. 
that's the oldest coffee shop in Amsterdam. As a building, it's currently it's bulldog. It's from 1970 something, 1975 as I remember. It's the oldest bulldog coffee shop. Oh, sorry about that, Tommy San. Maybe, maybe there will be a better opportunity in the future. So don't be upset about the previous opportunities, missed opportunities. That's maybe because you will have a better one in the future. Welcome to follow my travels motivational chats. Here we are in front of the old church. The most famous famous area. The women are not at work at the moment here. Three windows. They're closed, maybe they are working inside, I don't know. <laughs> so when there is a customer inside, they close the curtain. If you see a closed curtain in this red area, there might be two reasons. Either a customer is working hard inside or they are not in their working hours. That's one of the most crowded and popular streets of uh, the Wallen area. And I think it's better to follow that way because this side there are women <laughs> and possible dealers. I don't want to get into fight with them online. <laughs> This Turkish guy is saying, are you ready to his friends? <laughs> ready for what? <laughs> they, are, they are going into the hard worker woman area. And the guy is saying, asking to others, are you ready? Of course, 24 hours, seven days, 24 hours. He's ready. Well, I'm so excited. We are getting closer to my drinking area. Look at that amazing coach. The red zone window view from that coach. <laughs> this guy is, uh, has a great view. <laughs> you, you can see, they can see all the transactions going on th throughout the day. There's a Febo here at the corner. 
On the next corner, the red zone continues. This is those damn bald guys. Uh, I will go through to the place where my friend works. We will get a beer chair and then we will continue probably. Because it's such a good weather and I'm still not bored about walking around. I still have energy so you guys are lucky today because of the good weather. I have more energy and I can show you more around. So don't forget thumbs up. To motivate me. By the way, guys, you, I know most of you think a lot of things are free to do in Amsterdam, but in this area, you cannot smoke. There is 100 euro fee, uh, fine if you get caught. So in outside, in the Wallen area, you cannot smoke green stuff. Thank you, Paul and Tan Hats. <laughs> Guido, hello there. Olivier, hello. Good day. Okay, okay, okay. Let me show you the left side. And Flower Bikeman side. One of the most iconic views from Amsterdam Centrum, city centrum. Here it is. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> there is a bride here. Bride and friends, they are celebrating to get married. It's an old merchant house here. I think it's this monument, national monument, is under renovation, yes. It's empty already. It's going to be renovated. Here is the wheel. Well, my place is empty. I'll get a small beer here. And thanks for waiting. Me here. I'll try to get a beer as fast as possible. This is my corner. We are next to Zedaik, by the way. The next street is Zedaik. Oops. Oops. 
Hello. <laughs> hey, my friend. Hey, good. You good? You? I'm good. good. I'll get a small beer, normal pills. Like Heineken? Yes, please. Thank you. I'm online, so I don't come. I'm here. I'm online. Yeah. Oh, that's good to that's good to know some people around, especially as a videographer. So you can get the service faster because they know that you are. In you can get the service faster, maybe because they know that you are in a hurry. Thanks so much. <laughs> so you see. Small beer has already arrived. This is small beer, Heineken, cheers and prost. I think we already walked like one hour, probably. Let me show you the view as well. So. Okay, cheers. Yes, but I can't see you. I will change the camera wheel, just a second. Okay, that's much better, I think. So I can also see my back. Cheers. Uh, Mitsubishi. Uh, good to see you here again. Thanks a lot. Tommy-san, you're welcome always. I wish, I wish always the best for you. Really. Tommy-san, by the way. Okay, guys, Tommy-san has a YouTube channel and he has some videos. And recently I watched some of your videos, Tommy-san. Especially the one you arrived to Amsterdam first time in a typical Amsterdam weather. It's rainy and windy. And you are walking around the Lysa plain and also this area. Uh, as I remember on your video, but it's so depressive it, to be honest. Uh, I mean the atmosphere, the weather, it's so depressive uh, cons uh, comparing to today especially, but it was a very nice video. I like it. Thanks for sharing with me. <laughs> yes, of course, I watched the full video. This is a very busy corner of Amsterdam because of the perfect view here. This bar is always busy with this type of nice weathers. Hello, Maria. Orange West Link. Only two weeks later, there is King's Day and we're gonna start our walking tour on King's Day from Amsterdam Central Station. And we will see all our popular places we are going to visit Lost in Amsterdam. There will be a small party again in Lost in Amsterdam and all the stuff and the DJ will be wearing special orange Dutch costumes. We're gonna visit there, we're gonna visit here. Also, I promised our friend in Thai Street Bar, just 50 meters from here, uh, we will take a shot together on King's Day and then we will continue to Lysa Plain area or Jordan or 9th Street. <laughs> Maybe Tommy San, I think green stuff made it easier, I think, yes. Thank you Sundari. Cheers. When I finish this, we will continue and we will see the Damrak and Central Station area probably, or we can continue to Newmarket. Hello Stefan, greetings from Glasgow. Uh, I've never been to Edinburgh, but I have some plans to take the ferry from Aymadon to the Newcastle, and then I will take the train to somewhere around Edinburgh, I guess. So when I visit, definitely I will make a live video. And when will the smoke boat tour be? On another Saturday or Sunday when we have a good weather like this. We will just hop into a smoke boat. And I, I have to make ready my green stuff before that. I'll do G. 
I have so many orange stuff. So. Today we were in Albert Kuyp Market, by the way. There is a very nice pita, Middle East pita store, stall. Uh, pita Adam. The owner is Adam from Lebanon and the, he makes a, lo a lot of good choices about pita falafel or some other zatar and feta labne cheese stuff. I'll show you the video. We have a video. Uh, I'm sorry, not video, photo. So, this is the pita from Adam. In the middle of Albert Kuyp Market. It's mixed, lightweight, healthy. There are vegan choices. And those are my friends, Hungry Man Kitchen family. We are eating together. It was around 12 o'clock. Deal done for 20 Amsterdam. Okay, there is a vote for new markets. I think Sonar doesn't need the uh, green stuff. Remember, he tells a lot of story about the place on the wall. Hello Moldova, Andy. Welcome. Let me show you around a little bit. Much closer, I mean, with a better video quality. So it's a very crowded corner. It's always busy like this, especially in the sunny weather. There's also a quite busy bike traffic here. You have to be careful if you are cycling around. And there are many good bars on the back street. It's called Zedike. It's the beginning of the Chinatown. It's one hour and seven minutes already. That's good, we can continue. I, I got my fuel. We can continue like 30 minutes more, I guess. Hello, George. Thank you so much. Wow, you are great guys. We still have 126 people on the live chat, despite I'm just sitting around. Thank you. But we are drinking together, I guess. Olegas, hello. Thank you. You're welcome, Tommy san I think soon I will wear my jacket back again. It's getting cooler slowly, especially because I'm not walking at the moment. More thumbs up. Thank you so much for 20. I will make ready the payment for our friend. Yesterday I was around also, by the way, yesterday evening. Again, I was here at the same spot. Okay. 
Hello Pablo, Argentina. Thank you very much. No worries, it's already one hour and nine minutes, but you can watch it back. I'm sure you will watch it full later. But we will continue like 30 minutes more. Don't worry, thank you very much. Okay. We are done. Let's go. Oops. Just a second. Because there's music inside, I don't want to get closer. But, uh, oh, sorry. <laughs> okay, see you. All right. So, good afternoon. Welcome to Follow My Travels Amsterdam Live Walking Tour. Let's begin again. Because Pablo has just arrived, we are beginning from again from the centrum. For you, Pablo, we are starting again for another one hour. <laughs> just joking. But thank you. Okay, I will go through Zaydak. I want to show you the Zaydak Appian area. Let's follow this way a little bit. Okay. See the sun chairs, 20, 20 degrees Celsius is enough for some batting. I have to about 11th order. This is also pretty old chapel, I think. Not as old as, as old as the old church, the other kerk. We just passed through Appian, and this is the Oifar, the stock. Let's use the shortcut. That one is Warmostrad. Pretty old Amsterdam street. Another good boys here. Very old bar. Normally, when you cycle around Amsterdam, you don't hear these bike bells quite often. Here, you hear a lot because the tourists are all around on the way, and there are narrow streets, so there is not enough place for both pedestrians and the bikers. So, probably you remember this important landmark. It's a very old building and bar. 
<laughs> I'll turn around, I will walk through Warmostrad and we will come back to the same area again. Let's see if there's any change in uh, Warmostrad. It's Argentine, this one is Argentinian. Let me show you the prices. Steak, french fries and salad, 16 euro. Grilled chicken, 16 euro with fries and salad. Spare, everything is 16 euro. Almost mixed grills only, 20 euro. Hello. Hello. And that's Mexican, I think. Another Mexican. Cheese fondue since 1977 at Carbell. There's a great mask shop here. I love this store. There are professional masks are sold here. And the Joker. No, it's not a real person. There's a Chucky here. Chucky and Joker. Oh, beautiful glasses. I need one. For the king's sake, I'll, I'll buy one. This is the original Joker, Joker from Boris Brescia. This is the website, you can check their products maskshopvenice.com worldwide shipping they can send it to LA also guys this one is a Bob Marley place Hill Street Blues <laughs> One more hour. <laughs> I don't know. You know, since the beginning of this live stream, I didn't visit. Yes. Yes, how are you? Where are you from? From Amsterdam, I think. Pancake prices. Pancake with salmon, 15 euro. Pancake with fruit, 15 euro. Sweet. You heard it, Amsterdam is the best. Sweet. Little bar. This is a pretty touristic bar. Don't expect too much from the bars and restaurants from the streets. But absolutely it's so much fun around these bars. Not for the locals, but for the visitors, weekend visitors especially. There are so much fun, despite it's a bit overpriced, all the bars and the restaurants here. You, you can have a very good time on a Friday or Saturday evening night on the street. Another Hill Street Blues, another store. This one is new Juicy Burger. And we we'll sell absolutely fabulous Magic Truffles and much more. Get part fuel here. Those are Magic Truffles, fresh box. Different effects, different levels. Of course, we have a cheese store. Enter as a guest, live as a friend. This is hot and hot or not bar. <laughs> oh, look at that. What a couple. Hot or not. Hot or not. Okay, let's go. 
Yes. I don't know. Damir! That beautiful couple is going to hot or not bar with the order of the lady. <laughs> And churros, I love churros. Walk in, walk in. Tommy Sun's friends are here around. Kebab corner. There is everything you need on this single street. From vibrating things to masks, from Turkish kebab to Japanese wok. Ramen to lucky shots and drink and sing is the most meaningful bar name I have ever heard. It's the most suitable one. This is a great bar. I love this place. Cafe de Dörknit. Dörknit, that Dutch word in English, it means Rascal. Cafe de Rascal. Bar de Rascal. It's a fantastic place. And we are back to the normal people area, Damrak. Hello. Hello. How are you? Like Hello. <laughs> Hello. Do you have any friend here? Where are you from? No, we're just no, here. You are Dutch. Are you? No, we're not e Dutch. E we're English. Ah, oh, you're English. Okay. Yes, look, and the rest, we are German. I'm almost Dutch. Hang on, hang on. Hello. Where is your friend? Oh, here. Thank you. How are you? Oh, you look so relieved, <laughs> bless you. Sorry. No, no, it's okay. We are on live stream. You I've got, I've got are you enjoying your time here? Yeah, are you? Weekend trip, I think. I love it. It's ah. my first time on board. Yes. Last time. Have a good day. <laughs> what a nice couple. You see <laughs> how Amsterdam is crazy, you see. I didn't continue to interview because they will say something extraordinary. Serious fun. It's a serious fun. <laughs> Have a good time. Is Tony's chocolate is over there? On that small building, there's Tony's chocolate. You can create your own chocolate from that. By the way. So inside, it's a small place, not a big place, but you can create your own chocolate. You can produce your chocolate inside. Oh, I get a hotel that. Yeah. So you choose your ingredients and you can create your own chocolate. You can create a Tommy Sun chocolate. You can create a Mellow Family chocolate. Worldwide famous brand. No? The spring is here, Dutch tulips. Oh, it's not easy to cycle around, as you see, they are everywhere under construction. That's the spot where you can find dancing houses. A uh, very famous photo spot. I'll take a closer look for you. Look at the wheel. Never get tired of that view. Me too. It's already been eight years here. For eight years, I'm never bored about this view. It's great. Yes. Yes, a little bit sarcastic. It's a lucky day, it seems. <laughs> but 
but he, she was too drunk. I read uh, that Burger Fabric. I read that Burger Fabric Salcan pro tip for your next visit. Skip Burger Fabric, try Burger Bar. It's much better, believe me. It's a pro tip. Okay, okay, okay. Let's uh, take a look to Damrak and then we continue. We will continue to Central Station. I guess one of that side streets are uh, is deserve a visit. Deserving a visit. Oh, the half of the Damrak is closed. It's better to walk through in the middle of the street. It's too crowded. Side lines. Not this one, the previous one. The other one, we will turn right. Burger bar, Lysa plane. Yes, I tried that one also, but usually I eat it uh, in Warmustrat Burger Bar. There is also another burger bar on the right side, nearby Nivon Dyke. And there's an Amsterdam style store here. We got a tulips inside, hanging from. Oh, 420, are you still there? It's your name, Amsterdam 420. Who likes their fries with peanut sauce? Me. It's me. I like it with peanut sauce. It's the best to me. Also, a little bit samurai sauce wouldn't would be nice. Okay. This is the alley where you can find 420 coffee shop of Amsterdam. So we're gonna do that. Let's take a look. There is another cheese store and. Dutch clocks photo shoot spot. Here it is. She's in. Okay, this Lady Lale has, I guess, three coffee shops in, in one small street. You can find at least two, maybe three. Let me check. Hello World Wide Ghost Channel. Peter, hello there. Okay. Where was the, oh, here it is, 420 Cafe is here. It's a coffee shop. The place where you can smoke, you can buy green stuff. But you cannot smoke tobacco or you cannot order alcohol inside, only for the green stuff, buying and smoking. Oh, the other burger bar is just here on the next street. It's a new one, it's open last year, I think. Let me quickly show you. Here it is, burger bar, another one is here. There are many burger bars around the city nowadays. But it's a good one. Uh, Margaret has a suggestion, with it open on the Rhine? Yes, uh, we have been there last year. I have a live stream video from Alpen on the Rhine. 
but we didn't visit that Roman settlement. Next time when I visit there, for sure I will check for the Roman settlement. The previous time we only walked around the city centrum, the town centrum. But it was a beautiful town, I like that. The kebab show, the kebab show is here. This is a very popular and low-priced shopping street in Amsterdam Centrum. For Amsterdam standards, you can find a lot of budget-friendly stores here. On the street, it's called Nieuwendijk. Also, it's probably the oldest street of Amsterdam. The very popular hostel is here, Backpacker Hostel, Flying Pig. Actually, one of our watchers uh, was working here in Flying Pig Hostel. In one of my live streams, we bumped into each other last year. So many years. Most of those souvenirs have nothing with Amsterdam, to be honest. Most of them are just two steps. It's, they are not about Amsterdam history, Amsterdam daily life, nothing, most of them. Okay, so we are not far away from Lost in Amsterdam. Our friends uh, lunch, cafe lunch, lunch. So let's have a look. Probably there's a there's an outside sitting area. We can ask what they are planning to do on King's Day two weeks later. So as you see on the streets, throughout the, through the street, there are so many souvenir shops. And also some superstores. They are looking for stuff for the cake shop. <laughs> Don't say shit. <laughs> YouTube copywriter. <laughs> say in Dutch. <laughs> They're funny. Oh, we are back to the sunlight. There's a the discussion between the traffic staff and the taxi driver. The tram is waiting on the background. Alright, 
this is a street where you can find the lost in Amsterdam cafe lunch where you can smoke green stuff inside but you cannot buy it inside because they serve alcohol in coffee shops in Amsterdam they don't serve alcohol because according to the law either you can sell alcohol or you can sell green stuff you cannot do the both so in Los in Amsterdam you can smoke inside if you just like the smoke bot it's the same so you can smoke inside if we have already uh, green stuff with you but you can order beautiful cocktails and uh, uh, beers and alcoholic beverages whatever you think about that uh, there's no outside sitting area but let me see maybe We can just take a look and continue to our way or I can finish here. Hello. <laughs> Good to see you too. I just want to take a look. It's busy? No, it's very beautiful quiet night. Okay, I will get inside. Just uh, some short information about Kingsley. What are you guys? Yeah, we always have the oyster stand in here. That goes amazingly. Yeah, and a just, little just like last year, there. Yeah, you'll have a little stall oyster here. Oyster stand. You smell. We'll be cracking them open. We were all okay. wearing the little uh, With dresses. Orange yeah, yeah, yeah. costumes. We have the little dresses. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. You will be the queen. Of course, of course. <laughs> okay. No, actually, we also have a birthday girl this day, so it will be even more amazing. Ah, Louise during ah, the day okay, is her okay. birthday, so she is the queen. And then I will take over in the night. Okay, yeah, we will be on live from the central station and then we will come here, we will take a shot and we will continue, we will see you. We have all the shots for sure. All right. <laughs> Always welcome. I will come nice later, okay? Yeah, take sure. care. Okay. <laughs> Bye-bye. It's not busy inside, actually we can drink together, but there is a music inside, you know, for the copyright reasons. Uh, I don't want to get inside now, but for, for King's Day, for sure, we will come in here and we will try some yeah, you heard that they have oysters yes outside they serve oysters and some cocktails if you remember that last year we drank mojito yes there was a spanish girl here spanish stuff and she made a beautiful mojito cocktail for us that video actually it was watched more than 500,000 people uh, on Facebook and Instagram separately. Can't remember how much on YouTube. Paul Tan has you. I'm not jealous. I, I understand. I understood that for sure. Yes, you are right. Yes, uh, but uh, you know, we know each other for a long time, for years. I will tell you the story. I'll tell you an interesting story about this place, how I know this place, how I know the owner and the manager. I used to live in Istanbul and I used to go to the International Salsa Festivals as a videographer. I was making videos for International Salsa Festivals. So I know a lot of people from all other countries, from the Middle East, Europe, etc. Anyways, uh, when I moved here, I received a message from one of my friends who uh, she's dancing uh, and she's competing in dance competitions she sent a message that my aunt is working in a coffee shop in Amsterdam maybe you can meet and you can visit her and you can say hello from me so after I moved here like three months later four months later I came here and I asked, I asked for her aunt and the staff showed me that lady that's how we met so from that moment, we have a good friendship. I always come here, like, I mean, a few times a year. We, like, came here, I come here and we get drink together, you know? That's the story, how we know each other. Do you 
Look at the central station, Prince Hendrikad area. Look at that. The whole area is under construction now. Oh. No way to the left side any longer on this small narrow area. Hello, United Kingdom, Ian. Hello there, how are you? Ah, we will use this temporary way to go to other side, but let's continue to this side. It's uh, much faster. I'll go back to Zedike. That's why we are walking towards this side. So I have to visit the toilet. So around Zedike, we're gonna finish this video. It's already one hour and forty minutes, and we had so much fun today on the live stream. We saw a lot of interesting things, and there will be more in the future in the summer. I have some interesting plans for you. The first one is the smoke boat tour. As soon as possible. In the first chance, we will do that. I think Soner cannot join us. He's a, he's a Turkish herbal tea guy, not a green stuff guy. I'll find someone who enjoys green stuff. And we're gonna join to the boat together, or in the worst case, I will do it myself. Look at that. Welcome to Amsterdam Lovers Canal Cruises. Here it is. Look at the mess here. I believe it's going to be take like a year before it's back to the normal situation. Right. You cannot cycle around any longer. Look, you have a beautiful terrace here with the construction view. Outside. There's a little balcony here. This hotel is always full. Hotel Alpha. It's written full again on the window. Looks pretty clean. It goes to New Slaughter to the west. Greetings Texas, Robert Santos, Robert Santos and Jacob, hello there. Well, let's cross the road since it's not too busy now. Back to the sunglasses. Amsterdam Central Station is over there. It's been quite a long video.
but we have we had longer videos in the past like we had three hours video and six hours video from a king's day <laughs> that was crazy and it's 6 30 here let's take a look to water side before continue to Zedek. Of course, the boat tours are busy today. Look at the crowd. It's so busy comparing to the previous week. Look at that. Thank you, G. It's always my pleasure. Thank you so much for watching. Okay, okay. Another time we will do a live evening walk tour, evening or night. So you can see the evening or night drunk atmosphere of Amsterdam city centrum. I don't know when, because sunset is after 8.30 nowadays, but soon we have to do. There's an interesting boat is coming towards us. It's like a living room, living room boat. Take a look closer. Look at that. It's quite comfortable. It looks. Okay, I guess we are at the end, guys. Thanks very much for watching this for a long time, especially most of you. And I have to finish because I will run into a toilet, the closest one. <laughs> Otherwise, I will do it here and I will get a fine for that. So I will run into Zedek and I will get into one of the toilets over there that's a happy ending thank you very much see you tomorrow tomorrow another one by the way see you tomorrow after 3 p.m central european time bye bye don't forget thumbs up to support my videos thanks a lot margaret texas epic walk paul thank you very much I'm glad you enjoyed this. Tibor, hungry. T see you. Goodbye. I'm running now. Bye bye, Tommy San. And Paul Morris, see you. <laughs>